friends now i will discuss about composition of the oral rehydration solution and how will you remember that easily a new formula for oral rehydration salts has been released by the who that is world health organization it is widely used to treat children with acute diarrhea since who adopted ors in 1978 as its primary tool to fight diarrhea the mortality rate of children suffering from acute diarrhea has fallen the new improved formula is the result of extensive research sponsored by who's department of child and adolescent health and development for more than 25 years who and unicef have recommended a single formulation of glucose based oral rehydration salts to prevent or treat dehydration from diarrhea irrespective of the cause of the age group affected now the goal was a product that would be at least as safe and effective as standard ors for preventing or treating dehydration from all types of diarrhea but which in addition would reduce stool output or have other important clinical benefits one approach has consisted in reducing the osmolality of ors solution to avoid possible adverse effects of hypertonicity on net fluid balance this was done by reducing the solution's glucose and salt concentration so now we'll discuss how you easily remember the composition so in ors there is sodium chloride that is 2.6 gram this 2.6 gram how can you remember first in sodium the word is di that is di di means 2 so this 2 word comes from this word di and c chloride c can be written as this number 6 so 6 can be easily remembered by this letter and there is one gap between sodium and chloride so there is one decimal 2.6 gram next item is sodium citrate so here there is also di that is 2 so there is 2 and citrate in citrate letter there is c so that can be written as 6 so 6 is present and trat rotate and that indicates the word rotate so if you rotate the word 6 that will actually form the number 9 so this is 2.9 you should remember that 2.9 rotation of 6 2.9 and there is also one gap that indicates the decimal then potassium citrate how will you remember that potassium that is p p for primary so one letter so the number one here is number one in one and there is one gap so there is decimal and there is also c in chloride so that will indicate six and there is no rotation here because the rotation or trait word rotate that is only in citrate so this is 1.6 and finally glucose glucose is very much unlucky so it can be indicated by the number 13 and because why glucose is unlucky because only if only glucose is applied without any salt solution the patient will be more dehydrated so there will be no there will be no cure so this glucose is unlucky for this dehydration patient so you can remember the number 13 and s can be written s of the glucose can be written as the number 5 so this is 13.5 13.5 so you can remember this four component there is in one packet of ORS solution 2.6 gram sodium chloride 2.9 gram sodium citrate 1.6 gram potassium chloride and 13.5 gram glucose is present in it should be these components are dissolved into one liter of fluid water and used so what is the now what is the concentration concentration of each component so how will you remember that first is glucose so the last word of glu last word of glucose is ac so ac 
is for 75 so thus you can remember that glucose is of 75 millimole per liter then sodium is also 75 so glucose is ended with s e and sodium is started with s so that is also 75 chloride so that is c you can also write it in this manner so this is 65 and first three and the first three component the end number is 5 so that is the mnemonic and lastly potassium and citrate how will you remember potassium potassium there is two are t and u t u for two and there is one zero for the last two component potassium and citrate so this is 20 2 0 and citrate there is the word last two word is t so this is 10 now if we if you uh, add all this component the total concentration is 245 millimoles per liter so this is the concentration of who ORS solution In 2003, WHO and UNICEF recommended that the osmolarity of oral radiation solution be reduced from 311 to 245 mOg per liter. So, these guidelines were also updated in 2006. The recommendation was based on multiple clinical trials showing that the reduced osmolarity solution reduces stool volume in children with diarrhea by about 25% and the need for IV therapy by about 30% when compared to standard oral radiation solution. The incidence of vomiting is also reduced. The reduced osmolality oral rehydration solution has lower concentration of glucose and sodium chloride than the original solution. But the composition of the concentration of potassium and citrates are unchanged. The reduced osmolality solution has been criticized by some for not providing enough sodium for adults with cholera. So I think you have you can now remember this composition is very easily and the concentrations value of concentration hope you have liked this video please like this video and subscribe my channel prefrontal cortex and stay updated for other videos thank you